the endoscopes have been main tool for the ENT surgeon. Now endoscope has got a vast uh, wide uh, ability to reach the ear, nose, throat and also into the larynx. So uh, now endoscope has been used uh, for reaching the middle ear where the crevices or the blind areas which are not easily approachable by the microscope we use an endoscope which has got a wide angle to reach all these nuisance crevices to reach into the small spaces where we can do clearance of the tumor face is nothing but functional endoscopic sinus surgery where uh, the normal sinus are being opened up to make it uh, more uh, air protective and more sinus protective one or two episodes of sinusitis is that we give a medication, local medication in terms of nasal drops, antibiotic to make this opening better. In surgery what we do is that we go and each inspect each sinuses. Before we going for the surgery we do a CT scan to see exactly where is the problem and how to clear it off. So what we do in a sinus is that we open the sinus opening to a larger extent remove all the unhealthy mucosa or the pus, mucus, whatever is that. We give irrigation to it so that the sinus becomes very clear and we close it off. What is the advantage of this? Because the opening has become very wide enough so there is less of chance of mucus to accumulate and starts flowing. Which also gives an uh, opportunity to clean the sinuses on an OPD basis because we can reach all the part of the sinus with a large opening inside. So this is the best treatment available at present for the sinus infection which is not getting better with the medical treatment.